Hello, I'm Jerry Fort. Gonna do a Mexican suck, uh, Mexican lollipop sucker, whatever you want to call it. This is the Lopez um, lollipops with chili. Um, some of my subscribers have been talking about the Lopez. Um, I think it was, I think it was Malcolm Wolf, Steve, that was talking about that this was a pineapple flavor. Wasn't it you, Steve, that said something about that? Pineapple? But this is strawberry on it. <clears throat> Chili pepper powdered, powder, covered, ac acidulated, lollipop strawberry artificially flavored um <clears throat> it's made by dulces vero um like i said on the other on the vero mango i a little confused about that it's in a mi costanita uh package um because it doesn't i mean it doesn't say anything about it on here about mi costanita so i don't know why they're putting it in this package but it says quality candies like they're responsible for it i so i just don't know <coughs> and i haven't looked into it you know to research it or anything about why it's in, in these packages um but <clears throat> it says packed and distributed by yoli incorporated um okay so this is well, I guess it's supposed to be shaped like a strawberry, I guess. <clears throat> I don't know. Sugar, corn syrup, chili pepper, chili pepper powder, some salt. Um, let's see. I think that's pretty much about it. Mentions Grupo Bimbo which is responsible for a lot of different candies. Made in Mexico. <clears throat> okay. Let me let you see this. What do you think? Does that look like a strawberry? It's, if it's strawberry flavored, you would assume it would be a strawberry shape. It's not shaped like a strawberry. It's actually shaped like, uh, <clears throat> I think Steve was mentioning that it's shaped like a corn cob. And I think he said that elotes was a corn cob, um, a, a cooked or some kind of a corn cob cooked with something on it. Shoot, I can't remember what he said. But yeah, you can see the texture there that it looks more like a corn cob there. See? So it's a strawberry, strawberry flavored corn cob. <laughs> I don't know. Um, smell, you can smell the chili powder. Really good. It's not really covered thick on this one. <clears throat> But <clears throat> like I was saying on the Vera Mango back in the 90s when I first discovered the Vero mangoes, I, uh, or those type of Mexican candies, I, uh, the Vero mangoes, I would <clears throat> get big packages of 50 of them for decent price. Um, when we was working in Texas for this restoration company, um, my brother and I went over into Mexico right across the border. There was a little store 
and we went in there and I found a big bunch of them for a really good price brought them home um, but uh, when I go to work I would just have my own mouth up there. Brush on, brush off. And just, and, and we had a, our, our staff was probably 75, 80% Hispanic guys working for us and uh, working with us. And uh, I had my own office. I was the warehouse manager. So I would put out a big can full of different candies. And uh, I would sell them to the guys. And uh, I made a little bit of profit, but only so that I could afford to buy more candy. <clears throat> and uh, I think I charged... What was it? I think I charged like 25 cents a piece for these. This package here was a dollar for, for four of them. It's a pretty good price. Getting through to the sweet stuff now. That Vero Mango that I did the other day. Um, I don't remember this happening before, but when I was done eating that sucker, I looked at my tongue and it was totally red. And then that evening, it was still red. The brush of my teeth and my toothbrush was red. It was like there was a lot, of, a lot more food coloring than it was something that it used to be. I changed it up. Over the years, I guess. Okay, so you can kind of see the yellowish color there. They're kind of confusing because you'd think that it being strawberry flavored, it'd be red, but it kind of looks like pineapple. Kind of has a pineapple color or orange. I want to try to bite a little bit off of it so I can get to the, the flavor part. I'm not getting strawberry. Hmm. There we go. I bit it. It doesn't say anything on here about strawberry. It didn't say anything on here about a flavor at all. It just says corn syrup, sugar, corn syrup, chili pepper powder, artificial flavors. No, that's pineapple, not strawberry. <clears throat> I don't know why they'd lie to me. Get it. It's good though. <clears throat> okay. Well, I'm going to end it there. Hmm. See how it goes with my big meat michelada.
Oh yeah, it goes just fine. Of course, it's fruit and vegetable. It's cucumber. Just fine. Okay. Well, I thank y'all for watching. I appreciate it. And we will see you on <clears throat> the next one. I got a couple, a couple more candies to do. So, stay tuned. Bye.